Mental Fox here with more Elden Ring. Thanks for joining me again. When I loaded up the game, uh, installed a big patch. Pretty big patch. Took a little while to install it. I didn't really read what the patch did, but I saw a post somewhere where they talked about that like a lot of things were buffed. But uh, yeah, I didn't pay too much attention to it. I don't even know if I'll even notice the difference as I play. Probably won't. But anyway, we're here in believe it or not, Ariza Hero's Grave, but we are way back here, so this thing really, really goes far underneath here, underground. Um, I feel like there's still a place in here that uh, I haven't seen yet, so we're going to go back to, not the starting, because I think that'll take me to the, like the entrance entrance, and I really just want to go back to the... Um, the site, and then I, th like I said, I think there's one area that I still haven't been to in here. So as much as I like this outfit that I'm wearing, um, you know, it's it makes me heavy. Uh, so I'm going to go ahead and switch back to this other shield I've been using. And maybe at some point I'll play around with shields and see if there's another one that I would rather be using. But just simply changing the shield puts me into medium load, so that's cool. So I can run with this outfit. I don't know how it compares to the other one I've been wearing. Like, for example, the... The chest part here. If we compare it to... Radon's lion armor. See, the lion armor is heavier. And it does offer better protection. But this, this isn't bad. This armor that we're currently wearing. Oh, I didn't realize they had crucible tree armor and crucible axe armor. I didn't realize they had both of these. <laughs> anyway, we'll play with this for a little bit. Uh, obviously, I'm not going to use this weapon. I'll switch back to this. Not that I'm really expecting to fight anything in here right now. Right now, I'm just going to like try to run past everything. And um, get to this one area where I, it, it's like where we drop down. Uh, Turn a little light here. Okay, I'm not too concerned about him. Oh crap! Yeah, I did not uh, did not do that well. That was terrible. Bad job by me. So. I can't remember how to get to where I want to get to. I think there's actually an easier way, but I don't remember how to get there. So we go here, run through here. I still haven't turned on my little lamp yet, have I? Run through here. Pick this guy up over here. Okay, run over here. Make sure to avoid getting run over by these things. Up some runes on the way, and now I finally made it here. I'm gonna go turn on my little light. Okay, so I'm gonna try to drop down here. Oh, daggone it, man! Oh, I can't tell you how much I really hate doing this. Oh my gosh. Shoot, I mean, that's a fair amount of runage there that I don't want to lose. Well, crud, man. Uh, I really didn't want this to turn into a big, long endeavor. What happens if I go this way instead? I've always been going to the right. What if we go to the left here? That seemed to work out pretty well. <laughs> you could hear that um, Skelly was chasing after me. And then the chariot thing ran over him, whatever those things are called. Well, I mean, if there's one good thing about doing this over and over again, it's that I get more and more grave violets. Okay, get here. Hold on here just a moment. We'll wait for this guy to come down. I walk over there. Okay, now I'm going to walk here. I'm going to pick these up, and then I'm going to stand back over here again and wait. What was that? Okay, now should be right here, right? Oh my gosh, look how close. 
Okay. So now we're going to drop down again. Right. And then we're going to drop down here. Okay. And s that looks so far, though. Am I wrong? And then I can't go down there? Maybe we go here. And uh, drop down on this thing, maybe. Ugh. Okay, and now from here... Yeah, see that whole... That place over there we haven't been to, I don't think. There's a skelly there. Ooh, there's a ladder. Okay. Oh, gosh. Um... I'm always worried that I'm going to, like, take a little step here when I'm doing this, and I'm going to fall off the edge. Let's see. Okay, he's trying to throw stuff at us, but he's way too far away. So I'm going to go ahead and slowly get rid of him so that I don't have to deal with him. I mean, heck, as far as I know, he'd throw something at me and push me off that beam. So we're just going to go ahead and take care of him here. So we don't have to worry about that happening. Just have a little bit of patience here while we do this part. Almost got him. What one more should do, I think. Gotta line it up. Okay. He, oh crap! I'm gonna hit him again. I didn't think about that. Does little this count? Did that work? It did. Okay. Good. 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 Okay, so here we go. I'm gonna try. Problem is that I can't, I can't get the camera directly above me, which is kind of what I want to have happen. Okay, we survived that. <laughs> my foot hanging off there. Okay, now I'm gonna just simply try to run straight forward, but that's easy, even easier said than done. Just kind of look around and see if there's anything else here while I'm here. Hopefully there are no other enemies hiding over there that are going to surprise me and knock me off there. There's a good chance that other skellies will pop up when we get closer. Okay, so far so good. Okay, so we came all this way for a ladder. Let's see if this takes us anywhere cool. I hope it does because that was a little bit of work, right? Let's see. Who the heck are we? Oh, what? What was that? What was that? Oh, I think it was a chariot materializing. Okay. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a... what? Wait a minute. Is there... Alright, I'm not... I'm not putting this together in my head. How am I here? Huh? How am I here? We're just back here again. Is this... Oh, this is, this is a different place, isn't it? Okay. Boy, it looked exactly the same with that Grave Violet being in the exact same spot. But this is a, this is a different place. I have to figure out how I'm going to do this. Okay, this is pretty weird. Just looking for... Okay, right now we'll go here. Right here. Gotta be careful. If I get too far out there, that thing could chop my head off. Okay, now what? Is there an alcove down there for us? Do we need to go up here, maybe? Oh, crap. There's nowhere for me to hide here. Yeah, he hit me. Oh, okay. Whoa, whoa. Holy cow. There's a whole other area here. What in the world? Still don't know what these are for here. And then there's a whole 
area down below. Down there. That I don't know where that goes either. Oh, this is fascinating. Okay, so we got this guy breathing out fire. Okay. Alright, so we'll go ahead and pick this up. Get us a little bit of Grave Glove Wart 6. Let's give this guy a smack. Oh, he's going up. Oh, I was not expecting him to go up. Holy cow. Oh, crap. Which one of these is going to breathe fire? Okay, that one's breathing fire now. What on earth is going on? So I rose that thing up, but I don't really know what that did for us. I can't get on top of this thing. It's no way I can. What in the world? Where does this take us? Um. Well, I'm gonna go ahead and hit it because I feel like. Ah, crap! I don't know, man. Now we got this thing to deal with. Oh no! What a doof. don't know what to do here. Oh, nicely done, dude. Sheesh. You gotta be careful down here. I'm sure as hell don't want to die now. But I got a way to come back. Um, I don't see an alcove. Am I just supposed to try to run faster than this guy? Just deal with it? gonna get me. Oh, I, I thought I, I thought I was gonna make it there for a second. He's probably gonna change course and come down here now. Okay, we got a couple skellies around the corner. Is he gonna come all the way down here now? Sure enough, he is. <laughs> what in the world is going on? Okay, we got a down down there. I'm going to go this way because I think this might take us to where that thing is that we pushed up. The thing with the fire breathers on. Oh, there's a there's an elevator here. Okay, so this is the thing that we pushed up. <laughs> what in the world? Okay, well. Huh. Well, I can't go that way safely. So let's hit this thing. I don't know. This thing is still too tall to get on top of. I was hoping that I could get on top of it from here. What is the purpose of this? This is blowing my mind. We got an item here. Great dragonfly head. Three of them. Okay, so here's a little drop down place. Okay, so this is... We've been down there, I'm assuming. This is where there's the two chariots going back and forth. And up here to the left is where that other gr gray violet thing is or whatever. So we've been there. But what is the purpose of this? Normally you hit them to maybe ride on top of them or something. What in the world? I don't know. I don't know what that's for. Well, there's still a path here. Down and to the left. I feel like there's more to this. I think I'm missing something. Okay. Alright, 
so we go here. And then let's see what's down this way. Oh, a big dude. Okay. What do I want to use against this guy? Is this weapon that I'm using now going to be okay? Pretty big dude. Oh crap, he heard me. Nope. Nope. That was just me tanking him, totally. No finesse, no strategy, just just taking the hits. I can afford to do that sometimes. And he was guarding Crucible Feather Talisman. Let's check it out. A talisman fashioned from feathers that embody the aspects of various creatures. Looking at the picture of it, what am I looking at? Can't tell what that's supposed to be. Improves the inf the effectiveness of dodge rolls, but increases damage taken at all times. A vestige of the crucible of primordial life, born partially of devolution. It was considered a signifier of the divine in ancient times, but is now increasingly disdained as an impurity as civilization has advanced. So if I put this on, does my dodge roll look any different? I mean, maybe? I don't know. I can't tell. It probably lengthens the iframes or something. You see, there is a new icon in the upper left-hand corner. I think the second one from the right, maybe? Well, the one on the far right, I don't even know what it is. So I'm going to take this off. We'll switch back to the one that gives me more runage. Kind of like that one. Oh, well, okay. So it looks like that other thing actually gives me two icons. One of them is probably for the inc the increase of dodging, and the other one is probably the increase in damage. Okay, so we got this guy here to deal with. I mean, do I want to go back up there? I don't know. <laughs> Look how close it is to my head. I, I feel like there's more because I'm totally not understanding this totem at all. Let's just roll through this and see if there's anything underneath it. I don't know. I'm just trying stuff. Uh, okay, we definitely don't want to go down there, do we? Okay, so that's not going to work. So what am I not seeing here? What's with that fire-breathing totem? I, I don't know. I don't know. It seems to serve no purpose at all. I don't know whether I should go back up here or, or what. I don't know. Let's see this. Okay, this side thing I already tried in here. We haven't found any illusory walls in here at all, have we? So, what? Boy, it's awful dark in there. What is the purpose of this? I'm going to run in there. It might be stupid, but I'm going to do it. I just want to see if anything's different with this thing up. I don't know. Okay, so this is just going to take us back down there. I mean, I don't... I don't think I want to go back down there, right? We've already been there and spent time there. It's kind of maybe hoping that there would be some way to turn these things off. I know there's been other Heroes Graves we've been in where I'm able to, like, shoot them and eventually shut them up. Uh, but I don't think that there's any way to do that here. Ah, crap. My timing was not good. That was a bummer. Okay. I wanted to see if I could damage these things at all. Eh. They're like horrible timing. Horrible timing. Oh my god, could I have worse timing? Jeez. Okay. Does not seem as though I could damage those things at all. 
So what is the purpose of this? Why is this here? Look at that. There is an opening up there. How do I get to that opening? And what's also interesting is that there's one of those lights on it. Oh, it's a good thing I moved. I didn't know he was going to shoot that way. How do I get there? This is bizarre. I want to leave this as it is and just see what happens here. How far off does this breathe? Oh, all the way out. Wow. Goodness gracious. Well, this might be a dumb idea, but... Got a little shield up there. Oh, well, now that I'm way down here... How the heck do I get way up there again? So that I could... Try to figure out where that opening was that we saw. I think I'm just going to have to tank this guy. I don't really have much of a choice. Oh, son of a god, I jumped just a little too soon. Shoot. Lee. Yeah, we're just going to have to tank him. Ouch. Go. Hang out here for a moment. Freaking annoying. So he's... Yeah, I don't really have much of a choice here. If I want to go back up, I'm just going to have to deal with it. Right? There's no place for me to... Oh, couldn't quite make it. Shoot. I don't know the flask. I mean, the good thing is, is that I can get out of here ASAP if I have to. So now we're back here again. Um. Hmm. You could see. You could. Just way up there at the very top of the screen, there's one of those statues that shines a light. I haven't been able to figure out what those lights are for. Oh, it's going up. Yeah, I, I... What are they for? He's gonna breathe to the right now, yeah. So... I have no idea. This is, um... I don't even know if this is a, a puzzle to solve. If, I mean, it seems like it would be here for a reason. And I know I keep talking about those lights. Oh, this is not going to be good. Yeah. All right, well, I'm dead. Oh, crap. Now I have to get back there to get my runes, doggone it. Shoot. Well, boy, I really botched that up, didn't I? Is there a faster way for me to get there? I don't know if there is. Um... Boy, I don't know. Oh, what's... There is this thing here that I've never understood. Like, why is this giant hole here? Why is this here? Doesn't that seem odd? And then, you know, still the question of... The lights, why are they here? I don't know. I kind of want to try some experiments, but... You know, I got 40 plus thousand runes on the line. So I'm concerned about those. But what is this... What's with this light here? I mean, I had a thought... 
that maybe... Oh, are these guys... Ah, crap. Stupid skeleton coming out. Get the skeleton. Are these guys susceptible to damage when they're in that light? Is that a possibility? The skelly came back. Okay, this time we should get... Um, let's try it. Let's see what happens. Can I damage this guy when he's in this light? Kind of looks like no, huh? Kind of looks like... You know, I wish there were, like, um... Like, landmines in this game. Or maybe there are, I don't know. Like, something that I could just set on the ground. You know, that'll wait for him to get here. And then when he gets here, he sets it off. But... You know, I tried to hit him. What the? Whoa, what? Huh? Okay, I guess maybe I backed up just a little too much. And this guy behind me hit me? Is that what happened? Darn it. I wanted to try to try to get a hit off on him, man. But, uh, I mean, what are these lights for if not for that? I'm not fast enough. What if I try to pokey poke? This is... I don't know. Just just bear with me while I try some things here. Uh, where's the... I thought I had a pokey poke. There we go. So, is this a poker? Yeah, okay. Alright, here we go. Let's see how this goes. Just trying stuff, man. I don't know. Okay, I still didn't hit him. I, 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 I mean, I hit him with an arrow, so... I mean, what things can I craft? I mean, I don't think there's anything in here that, you know, I could just set on the ground as kind of like a proximity thing. I don't think that's a thing in this game. Right? Can't can't set down a landmine or anything like that. No. Now, if I was a magic user, what could I lay down a, a rune? Doggone it, man. I can't hit him. What are these stupid areas for? And there was a part of me that wondered if maybe I was invincible in that area, but I'm pretty sure I already tried that. That didn't work. Alright, we're gonna try a volcano pot this time. See if that does anything. And it didn't do anything. Oh, what the? Okay, well, somehow I got hit. Jeez. Alright. So. Oh, I got runes on the line, man. I gotta quit being stupid. I am really curious to see what's up that hill there, though. Is there an alcove I can hide in on my way up there? I can't tell. I don't think that there is. I think I just have to tank it. That's just how it is, man. Oh jeez. Oh jeez, is there anything? Okay. Oh. okay, so he turned. Have I been here? Oh. Thought I was gonna get beat. Oh gosh. Oh, there's no alcove over here. Ooh, it didn't get me though. There is an alcove over here though. <laughs> what am I doing? <laughs> Have I been here? And there's another one of those things again. Another one of those symbols on the ground. I do where I'm going from here. Oh. Whoa! What just happened? Did you see that? What? What? Huh? What the heck just happened? Ash of War Holy Ground. Tree Sentinel Helm, Tree Sentinel Armor, Gauntlets, and Greaves. What the hell just happened? What? Why did they... What in the world just happened? So it's almost as if this symbol did kill them this time. 
but why now and how? What on earth is going on down here? Somebody just shot at me from down below. I don't know if he's going to try to come up here and get me or not. What in the world? Oh, no. Yeah, so this is the area that I would drop down from into from above had I taken that other path. What in the world? Okay, so we picked some stuff up. Uh, I think one of them was a sorcery. Let's see if I could find it. Yeah, I think it was this one here. Golden Vow, is this one I just picked up? An incantation of Erd Tree Worship. Increases attack power and defense for the caster and nearby allies. Hold to continue praying and delay activation. This incantation has been taught to knights of the royal capital for generations, and knights sent on distant expeditions lean on it as a source of courage. I think that's what I just picked up. Not 100% sure. No, this is what I just picked up. This Ash of War, Holy Ground. This Ash of War grants an armament the sacred affinity in the following skill. Holy Ground, raise shield to create an Erd Tree consecrated area that continuously restores HP and boosts defense for self and allies inside it. Usable on all shields. Okay, that's pretty cool. That's what we just picked up. But what else we just picked up was a whole new armor set. Let's check it out. This one is called Tree Sentinel Helm. Why are we picking up tree sentinels to sentinel stuff way down here underground? I don't know. Golden Helm of the Heavy Cavalry Tree Sentinels who serve the Erd Tree. Very few are permitted to wear a golden wood crest of such size as seen on this helm. And then here we get Tree Sentinel Armor, Golden Armor of the Heavy Cavalry Tree Sentinels who serve the Erd Tree, adorned with a cape featuring the mark of the Sacred Tree. Imposingly sturdy and nigh unbreakable, the grace of old yet lingers. These are the Golden Gauntlets, same text, and the Golden Greaves, same text. So now we are in heavy load just simply wearing this outfit because it is... It is very, very heavy, um, but it probably offers some really good protection. Let's compare it to the stuff I've been wearing, the lion armor. You can see, well, I mean, it's comparable, actually. It's considerably heavier. Um, I don't know. I mean, it has, you know, better resistance in a lot of ways, better immunity... Better vitality, better poise, worst robustness, and the same focus. Uh, same physical damage negation, same versus strike, same versus pierce. A little better versus magic, worse versus slash, fire, and holy. So, I don't know. I mean, that's a considerable weight difference. I really don't know if it's worth, you know, that. So we're going to switch back to this outfit here. Got to see my face. Okay. Okay, well, um... I still need to go get my runes. I have no idea where they are in relation to where we are now. Actually, I do know where they are. They're down... Well, no, I don't. What in the world just happened? I mean, why did this suddenly destroy those things? Oh, gosh, damn you, you son of a gun. Where are you? This is not the right weapon to use for this guy. I'll probably use my mace. I mean, what the heck? I mean, in that place where we were just standing before, like in the in between area. Well, actually, one of these are gone now. Right, let's go back up here real quick before I go forward some more. Do 
there anything in here? Nah, yeah, just a double skeleton. I have to deal with now. Alright, what in the world is going on in this place? Okay, so if we go back here now... Is that one destroyed now too? Well, it certainly appears to be. I get these items now. What happened? Why are they gone now? Because, I mean, that symbol's been there this whole time. And he was just coming down here and turning around in it, and it wasn't bothering him at all. And then all of a sudden it did? What on earth? I'm actually going to go all the way back up to the top. Just to see if there's anything different up here. Because I'm curious about this. This, okay, nothing has changed here. What in the world? Now, if I... If I rest, will they come back? I can't remember if these guys come back or not. I think they will. Well, actually, no, they won't, will they? Because I got special items when they died. So I'm going to say that they won't come back. But I do not know why they died in the first place. What was so special about what I did? So freaking bizarre. It would be... Well... I was going to say, it'd be awesome if they were all gone now, but you can plainly hear that there's still some available around. And then, okay, oh, look. Oh, look at that. Look. That's the, that's, that's the column that we strike to raise up. And it's shining its light down here now. So, does that column stay raised between rests or deaths? Because now I'm thinking that maybe that's the secret. Maybe I raise that thing so that it shines its light down here to destroy those, but it still doesn't explain why that light up there didn't destroy them. Okay. There may not be any more mysteries left to solve in here. Nope. This one's going to come back right here. You, see? Look. That is that light shining up there. Well, I'm wrong. I thought he was going to come back here, but he didn't. And this just takes you right back to the boss. There's no reason to go down there. There's just some stupid skeletons to fight down there now. <sighs> Unfortunately, it looks like I have to drop down there and do that crap again. So I almost kind of want to say goodbye to my runes because there's no way I'm going to accomplish this again. I was kind of hoping, not just kind of, I was really hoping that now that these chariots are gone, they would have opened up, an, you know, another path for me so that I didn't have to do this business I'm getting ready to do right now. But I don't think that there is another path for me, is there? I don't think that there is. This is bizarre, man. I am so confused. Okay, we're gonna I'm just gonna go back this way. I don't think that there's anything here. I missed him twice. Back away from that mess. Stop it. Well, that's one way not to worry about runes. They're gone now. Gone now. Except that now I have this stupid rune icon here. Let's see if these things are still gone. I still feel like there's another mystery to solve. Maybe that's just there as a trap. Yep, sure enough, they're still gone, all right. I can't believe I just let that happen. I really can't. I cannot believe I let that happen. That's just ridiculous. There's no sense in it. Oh. Anyway, where? 
Okay, so this is a dead end. Oh, golly, I'm just swinging over top of Oh, for crying out loud. Gosh. Okay, so this is not the right weapon to use against those guys, because they just swing over top of them. Okay, so this is just a dead end. Yeah, okay. This is... man. Oh, good lord. I'm gonna get death blighted again. Roll out of the way, dude. Yeah, this, okay. So this doesn't go anywhere. I didn't remember who did it. I'm oh, gone. I'm gonna pick this up just to get it off the screen. No. I did it again. I mean, it's cool animation and all, but... Well, boy, I am certainly no hero. Um, well, you guys let me know if there's any anything else in here for me. I'm actually going to do something here real stupid. Yeah. Why did I do that? I want to tell you why I did it. I want to show you why I did it. I did it. <laughs> So that I could very easily get back to my uh, rune marker. I don't think I would put it here. That way I could just get to it real quick and get the heck out of here. Um, let's take this thing up and get out of here, man. Uh, let me know if I missed anything down here. I still do not understand what happened there. I really don't. I really don't understand it at all. And I, honestly, I'm not even sure... I mean, okay, so we killed the chariot dudes, and we got some items. We got that set of armor and that ash of war, so that was cool, but... Is there really any other reason to kill them? I mean, you know, once I killed them, was there really any benefit to having them gone? I'm not sure there was. Sheesh. Well, easy come, easy go with the runes. You know how it is. Oh, good gravy. Go on back here. Anything? No? Hey, <laughs> this freaking game. <laughs> this freaking game. You guys telling me what? I'm only halfway done with it? Are you serious? <laughs> There's no way. There's no way. Oh. Oh, okay. I just ran around behind this thing completely. Interesting. Yes, I know I was just here, but I didn't pick this up. Good grief. Okay, so we got a dumb old regular bear over here. Then we have a rune bear, which I need to make use of to open this statue here to get the items inside. And generally, they're pretty nice items, so it's going to be worth it. I can't believe how quick, uh, how closely I was able to get to that bear. Oh, there's another one. Close, I was able, not closely. Um, okay, well, let's see if I can't entice Rune Bear down here. Where are you, Rune Bear? Where are you? There's one up here, right? I'm trying to lock onto him. <laughs> Where the hell is he? There he is. I think that's him behind the tree there. Okay. Well, he got your wake. Okay. No, no, no. No, no, no. No, no, no. You're supposed to break this thing. Oh, you'd break it. Did he break it? Yeah, he did. Uh, two smithing stone sixes. Okay, now I'm just going to get the heck away from him because I really don't want to fight him. Two smithing stone sixes. Okay. <laughs> Stupid bear. Look, look how much... Look at this. Look. Let's see. 116. Uh, oh, he can get me from a distance, too. Uh, let's see here. I have some... I think these are poison arrows. In your face, bear. Boy, these do some damage. Poison? Whoa, doing some damage to Mr. Bear. So he's all poisoned and stinky now. 
So I know that rod is better than poison, but rod arrows are very hard to come by in this game, is my understanding. There's like a limited number of them. I don't know if that's true about poison arrows or not. Oh, right, right in the bunghole. Oh, oh, I've lost uh, range now. Oh, he's coming back. Good lord, his, he's got some range. I didn't think he could hit me from there. <laughs> ah, brother. Um, do I have any fire arrows? I have fire bolts. Well, perfumer's bolts. These don't... Fl oh, okay, so I could go here. I could go to Fletched. Oh, those aren't Fletched. Fire Bone Arrow, Fire Arrows. I don't know. Seems like fire would do really good against a bear. I don't think I'm going to hit him from here, though. Uh, I didn't. That was the wrong arrow, anyway. He's still poisoned. Oh, dang it. Jeez, uh, why don't you heal yourself up a little bit there, dude? Oh, good god. Oh, okay. <laughs> Just, everything's freaking annoying. Oh, sounds like he's off to the side of the building here. Are you dead yet, bear? Where'd you go? What are you doing? What are you doing, bear? Ouch. Ouch. Hmm. 3,500 runes. And some beast blood. I said it before, I'll say it again. Not worth the efforts. Absolutely not worth it. Okay, let's run up the hill here. So... We got the bear to destroy that statue thing. We were able to get the two smithing stone sixes inside of it, so that's always nice. So that was cool. Mission accomplished. We didn't die. Now we're going up the hill here. Because somewhere up here, I believe, is another cave. Because the statue told us about it. And here it is ourselves a cave and a big drop off Ooh, look at this place all right now we're in a Ariza side tomb we are going to end this episode here if we come back we will explore a Reza side tomb, and then after that, we're gonna take a bit of a detour. We're gonna go back and see if we can't finish Ronnie's quest. Uh, we'll go back and pay a visit to uh, Selen. And um, there's also still some areas in the game that we haven't been to yet. Uh, that maybe we'll go back and uh, fill in before we continue on our quest over here by Landell. That's my plan anyway. We'll see what happens. Thanks for joining me. Hope you had a good time. If you did, why don't you let me know? Leave a like or a comment. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.